Hello everyone, this is Mamta Mond and today we are going to solve some self-practice exercise questions 1 to 10. Self-practice 1M of chapter 1. Chapter name is Knowing Our Numbers of class 6 of New Learning Composite Mathematics Textbook. If you have not subscribed to my YouTube channel, then please subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the bell icon for getting notifications of future videos. And if you like this video, then please click the like button. And please visit my blog massgrade.com for more information regarding the textbook solutions of CBSC, ICAC and other state boards. Let's get started and solve some questions. Today we will learn and solve self-practice exercise questions 1 to 10, self-practice 1 M of chapter 1. Chapter name is knowing our numbers and topic is use of brackets to find the solutions. Let's solve some questions. Now we will solve question number 1. Question number 1 is solve the following. 6 plus 2 multiplied with 5. And 2 multiplied with 5 is inside the bracket. According to Borma's rule, we have to first find, first calculate the brackets. Inside the bracket, we have to find the calculation. Then brackets. Over of brackets that is parenthesis brackets or parenthesis o for of that is multiplication and d for division m for multiplication A for addition, S for subtraction. Now first calculate this inside the bracket that is 2 multiplied with 5. First we have to calculate that is 6 plus 2 multiplied with 5 is 10. Now add this value 6 plus 10 is 16. So our answer is 16. So 6 plus 2 multiplied with 5 is 16. Now question number 2. 6 plus 4 more. We, 6 plus 4 is inside the bracket. That is the, inside the parenthesis. Then multiply 5. First we have to find the calculation inside the bracket that is 6 plus 4 and 6 plus 4 is 10 10 multiplied with 5 10 multiplied with 5 is 50 our answer is 50 so 6 plus 4 multiplied with 5 is 50 now question number 3 3 plus 6 plus 8 and 6 plus 8 is inside the bracket First, we have to find out the calculation of this addition that is inside the bracket. It is 3 plus 6 plus 8 is 14. And 3 plus 14 is 17. And 17 is the answer. So, 3 plus 6 plus 8 is 17. Now, question number 4. 10 minus 3. 10 minus 3 is inside the bra bracket plus 13. First, we have to calculate this subtraction that is inside the bracket. We know 10 minus 3 is 7. 7 plus 13. And 7 plus 13 is 20. So, 20 is the answer. So, 10 minus 3 plus 13 is 20. Now, question number 5. 18 minus 3 plus 5. And 3 plus 5 is inside the bracket. First, we have to calculate this addition that is inside the bracket. 18 minus and 3 plus 5 is 8 and 18 minus 8 is 10 so answer is 10 so 18 minus 3 plus 5 is 10 now question number 6 8 multiplied uh, with 15 that is inside the bracket minus 20 first we have to calculate this multiplication that is inside the bracket 8 multiplied with 15 is 120. 120 minus 20 is 
100. So 100 is the answer. So 8 multiplied with 15 minus 20 is 100. Now question number 7. 27 minus 6 multiplied with 4. First we have to calculate this multiplication that is inside the bracket. 27 minus 6 multiplied with 4 is 24. And 27 minus 24 is 3. 3 is the answer. So 27 minus 6 multiplied with 4 is 3. Now question number 8. 30 minus 112 division of 14. And 112 division of 14 is inside the bracket. First we have to calculate the division that is inside the bracket. So 30 minus and 112 division of 14 is 8. And 30 minus 8 is 22. 22 is the answer. So 30 minus 112 division of 14 is 22. Now question number 9. 35 minus 15 that is inside the bracket division of 4. First we have to calculate this subtraction that is inside the bracket. So 35 minus 15 is 20 and 20 division of 4 is 5. 5 is the answer. So 35 minus 15 division of 4 is 5. Now question number 10. 80 minus 5 multiplied with 6. And 5 multiplied with 6 is inside the bracket. First we have to calculate this multiplication that is inside the bracket. So 80 minus and 5 multiplied with 6 is 30. 80 minus 30 is 50. And 50 is the answer. So 80 minus 5 multiplied with 6 is 50.